What a moment in history. Oh my God. TS7 is coming. We don't know exactly when. But it's coming. But it's coming. It's coming. I'm Katie Krause. I'm Oscar Gracie. And we've created this insanity, this board, this gorgeousness. It's literally a representation of our minds at this point because <laughs> we're losing it. We're losing it. Yes, so we're gonna run down everything we know, all the clues that we have maybe possibly figured out. Or just made up in our heads. Which is also quite possible, probably the truth right mm -hmm, there. Mm -hmm. But let's just get right into it. Please. Yes, starting with this picture, that really started off the new Instagram aesthetic. Sister snapped in this photo, honestly. I mean, gorgeous Cinderella moment. Yes. And then, this is when we started seeing a little bit of change. So, this little photo of Meredith, all snuggled up, a little purito, seemingly matched the same color scheme of this post. And this is when the sirens went on. This is when we were triggered house down boots. Yes. Mm -hmm. With her, it doesn't mean nothing when she does something Seven palm trees, guys. That means something. It means something. And she knew that we would lose our minds yes. trying to decode this photo. 100%. Then we get this one. We thought we're looking for the seven again. Mm -hmm. Seven stairs down. But oh, wait a minute. Is this maybe possibly a countdown? Because she's six stairs up. And Katie, what happened the next day when we saw this photo of the fence? We had a conniption fit, you guys. Mm -hmm. We were counting bricks, trying to make sense. Is there some sort of seven symbolism here? You guys, I zoomed into her sunglasses <laughs> thinking there was a hidden message in it. I, I thought I would see the release date <laughs> in her guys. lenses. But wait, one, two, three, four, five holes in the gate. The countdown is on. That's when we snapped, but truly. Then she snapped back. Oh, yeah, yeah. With Olivia. Yeah, because the next day we didn't get a post and she threw us all off. We're like, oh, maybe we're just insane. Maybe we're just crazy. And then she came through with Miss Detective Olivia Benson, just hanging on the bed. Caption. She just read all the theories. So um, our good mom obviously was just making fun of us at that point. Yes. She was really pulling our wigs. But still, we think something is happening because then we get this beautiful L cover, which still is in theme with the... Aesthetic. Mm -hmm. She doesn't just do covers unless something is happening. Pop's new power. The music issue. She takes control. Mm -hmm. it, it's happening. The, we know it's happening. And the pinks and the yellows perfectly aligning with this gradient. And the countdown is still on, you guys, because this doesn't throw anything off. This all still seemingly leads up to the end of the countdown, which is marked in the reputation calendar with a flower on March, March 2nd. 2nd. Let's sort of talk about all these theories. Is this the album that was supposed to come after 1989 before Reputation? Which is a solid conspiracy theory in my book, honestly. I think so too. I mean, who is this Taylor in the back of that Look What You Made Me Do video? Palm tree clad Taylor mm -hmm. covering up the plane with Reputation. The fact she is spray painting it means that this plane was not meant for Reputation. It means it was meant for something else and she had to cover it up and make it into this era. Which is why okay. we think the theme of this a, the color scheme is a graduation of 1989, mm -hmm. right? We had the Polaroids and the Pestels. Mm -hmm. Now we have more vibrant Saturated colors. gradients going on 100%. We, still matching up with yes. the palm trees to this photo. We think mm -hmm. there's like a coastal vibe. Yes. We think there, that's why she did the whole like Ariel, the mermaid thing. Which matches Tropical. up to this jacket she wore in a Reputation promo. It's a camo jacket, but we still see you, sis. On the back, seven palm tree patches on the reputation jacket. Nothing she does is on accident. No, the fact that this photo came out so long ago. This photo came out so long ago. She was ready and for it. The clues are, are still matching up. She guys. was already teasing all of this. She was already thinking about it. So to wrap up, let's go through the players really fast. Yes. Okay. Ryan Tedder, is it a coincidence that his Twitter header is palm trees? No, because Ryan and Taylor have worked together before. Ryan loves working with her, has said a million nice things about her. Jack Antonoff, he's been in the studio. That's a no-brainer no to brainer. me. No-brainer. They yeah. work great together. Katy Perry. This one's a little dicey. <laughs> it's not happening. Why? It's not happening. No. We see the theories. We see you. But, mm, nah. Max Martin. Two. Pop power. A hundred percent. Back to this. Yes, Pop's new power. They are Pop's power duo. Before we wrap up, album names. You guys, what are we thinking? I'm thinking maybe something like Paradise, um, maybe something floral like Bloom. I think Bloom is a big possibility. 100%. I think, like, Symphony of Color. That's the most gorgeous thing I've ever heard in my life, honestly. <laughs> gorgeous. The spectrum of it all, the rainbow, perhaps. Yes. We want to know what you guys think, though. Have we officially lost our minds? What do you think the new album is going to be called? 
when is it coming? When is it coming? Let us know. We are all over social media. We talk about Taylor all the time. We want to talk time. about Taylor with you. 100%. Yeah. I'm Katie. I'm Oscar. We'll see you next time.